He was once a world-ranked tennis player from Vanderbilt, but later in life, Charles Batt could hardly walk without wincing in pain. Severe arthritis in both knees made life miserable until he decided to take a bold step. Montepay with St. Thomas Health takes a closer look. To me, it started here. This is my uh, junior year in high school. I'm in the back with a little bit of hair. Just a little <laughs> bit of hair. His entire career is displayed on this one table. From an early age, I was born and raised in Wimbledon, so tennis was always part of our life. Still is. This is me in L.A. I was always a big lad, as, as my friend in England calls me, but at 240, I was in perfect shape. Charles Batt, a two-time SEC champion at Vanderbilt and world-ranked player. Just letting the racket do the work for you is the director of tennis at Hillwood Country Club in Nashville. And again, keep going. Good, attack it, rack it back early. Years ago, Charles slipped on the tennis court and tore a ligament in his left knee. The wear and tear from playing eventually took its toll on both knees. Whoa, people used to say to me, uh, when did you play tennis? And I said, ah, about 35 pounds ago, you know, so. Barely able to walk, much less run, his playing days are over. Even teaching tennis Surely feeling it bad. or walking the steps is difficult. All right, here we go. The end of the day for me is no fun. You know, it's ice and pain. At 57, it was now or never for Charles to do something about his knees. His knees are really, really worn out. Not only are they really worn out, they're very stiff with the arthritis. Dr. Philip Carpos at St. Thomas Health performed a bilateral total knee replacement on Charles, replacing the damaged parts of the knee joint with an artificial joint made of special metal and plastic. I tell patients I, I don't recommend a double knee replacement unless that's what the patient wants. And in his case, um, he's going to be very motivated to return to work. The next day, after double knee replacement surgery. I locked my legs yesterday, which everyone said, don't stand on. I said, I'm going to stand on. He spent a few days at St. Thomas West. Then it was straight to rehab. Make sure you go straight up. I was killing my joint. So good though. You got it. Good stuff. Well done. I feel like I wish there was a product out there five years ago I could have done this because it's it's phenomenal. The joy of being able to teach for seven hours and have no knee pain the whole time is um, I, just a privilege that I never thought I'd ever have again. Good. New knees, new outlook on life. Charles is back at the club teaching and more importantly, moving once again on the court. Now, if I can anticipate, I can move anywhere. There's a slight delayed reaction because I've got to tell myself to do it, but uh, there's no pain anymore. Dig it up. Good try, hon. Here we go. Oh, and remember how much trouble he had walking the steps before surgery? Not anymore. For, you know, for anyone out there that has struggles with this, and, and the doctors have said, look, you've got bone on bone, and you've really got to have a good look at this because it is life changing. That is remarkable. To learn more about knee replacement surgery at the St. Thomas Joint Replacement Institute, you can visit sthealth.com/joint or call 615-284-bone.